Good evening and welcome back once again. Last week we had a 3-0 away win against Lagones. We're back at home against the Beef there after only a few days break. Let's jump into the team lineups. And we've actually made some enforced changes. We brought in Houghton for Mudrick, just because he needs a bit of a rest, I believe. Took off Arcas, even though he's on a flashing up, so he will be improving dramatically. But again, his stamina is quite low. So we brought in Castledeem. Herrera's back in. He's playing in defensive midfield. Caulfield's going to play it right back, because as you can see, the youngster McDowell, he's on a downward red. Um, and that's about it, really. Other than that, there's a, the full strength. I love the whole home stadium of Malaga. La Rosaleda, or La Rosaleda, not sh quite sure how you pronounce it, but it's a beautiful stadium. Love playing at home. Let's see if we can keep up the pace. 20 points ahead in the league now. Ibiza, I think, are 9th or 10th. They're in the top half, at least. Now we've made a few changes, so you know you've got to be careful when you do that because um, it can dramatically decrease your team sort of chemistry. Nice ball, Xerxes. I uh, couldn't quite get the power on it. Nice interception there. It's good to have uh, Texera back as well. Castledean. Vieira, good block. Yeah, Vieira was, um, I said it in the last match, but he was a little bit absent. Good tackle for Momoragic there. Kovacevic is in place of Kostinu as well. I didn't mention that in the team lineup, and we're actually playing the, uh, the young goalkeeper. So, some pretty wholesale changes for this match. Nice ball from Vieira there. Oh, Nelly got it worked back to him for the 1 2. And Herrera playing in that slightly deeper role. He normally plays in centre mid, um, playing in defensive mid today. He has played there a few times before. That's a poor ball. Yeah, looking a bit out of sorts at the moment. Oh, good defending. Chance for a counter. Ah, it's poor from Carlos Perez. Trying the tricks. Not very good at them. I should stay clear of them, really. That's a bit better. Out to Vieira now. It's a terrible ball from Perez. Sloppy. Sloppy is the word I would go for so far. Going to try and get Vieira on the ball a little bit more in this game. I think we're going to need it. Not long, very sure in the middle of the park, though. That's better. Vieira, lovely ball to Xerxes. Oh, lovely save from the feet of the goalkeeper. Herrera wins it back. Vieira again. Vieira, oh, deflecting in. Wow, I think we needed a bit of luck to uh, get going in this game. Yeah, has been playing well, but by no means was that heading in, I don't think. It was on target, but it was it. I was trying to place it. It'd be interesting to see, because I was aiming for the top left. That's where it was heading, and then it hits the back of the defender's head and goes in. The keeper couldn't do anything about that. Let's see if it can work out. Ah, oh, the camera switched. It's a shame. Yeah, it was definitely going towards the top left, though. 
might make things settle down a little bit. I wouldn't say we've deserved it though. Again, a big gap in midfield. Nicely back to Herrera. Somehow the defender got to that. I thought Xerxes was in. Again, there's a big gap in defence. Don't know what is going on in in that. Uh, well, nah, that wasn't a foul. But yeah, there's just massive gaps appearing in defence in mid in the sort of defensive midfielder area. I know we've made some subs, but we've still got some really good players in there. Don't need to see a replay of that. There's no way the goal. going on that was a terrible pass got away with it that wasn't much better but might benefit from it here's Vieira now Castledean Vieira again good save it was pretty much straight at the key bit but it was on his weaker foot didn't have time to do much else. Nice play though with Castle Dean. Yeah. Couldn't do much else. Good win by Castle Dean. Caulfield, well, that wasn't Castle Dean. Herrera. Oh, my word. Wasn't too far over. Absolutely blasted this. Wow. Don't know how that's a free kick. Really don't. I seem to blow his whistle before. Was that from? Yeah, it was from a different part of the pitch. Don't know what happened there. Strange decisions with uh, free kicks in this game sometimes. But anyway, wind control just about. There it is. It's half time. Bit of a scrappy first half, but got the one nil lead. And the stats don't really tell the full truth, you know, 65% possession, 6 shots with 5 on target. We did not look comfortable at the back, quite a lot of loose passes from ourselves. Leading 1-0 is all that matters really. Certainly need to pick things up in the second half a bit. I think that's to be expected with the changes that we made, I just didn't, I suppose, expect it to make that much of a difference. But Herrera playing well, Vieira's playing well. Perez has been a bit lackluster sometimes. Takes on the charge though. Ooh, nearly a decent ball, just a little bit too close to keep it. If he could have fired it in a bit stronger, maybe would have troubled him. Nice header there. And that's a terrible ball from the right back. Herrera did well to win it back there. Just about won that back after losing it briefly. Oh, nice little effort to thread the ball through to Perez. He's certainly our main outlet when um, Mudrick's not playing. Oh, what's going on there? 
I'm not going to see a replay. We really don't want to see that. <clears throat> oh. Well, that's the best chance they've had. Probably the only chance. Should have scored, really. It was a little bit difficult because he was stretching, maybe. Um, give him the benefit of the doubt, but he should have scored. Going to make some subs now. And we're going to make three subs. We're going to bring on Carlson for Xerxes. I'm going to switch Harrington up top. Going to bring Bajer on for Carlos Perez. And we're actually going to put Rice at right back, which is a bit of a strange one. We're pretty weak in those positions and Caulfield has, well, he hasn't had a great game and Rice can probably just do a job there. So it's most likely going to be Carlson's last game, I would assume. He might play the odd one here and there just as a, uh, like these sort of games where you're just trying to give someone a rest, the game's, you know, it's not massively important obviously we'll want to win it that's a poor ball but we're 20 points ahead ideally we'll be making these subs if we're two, 2 or 3 nil up good tackle from Herrera he's been certainly one of the better players in this game oh, nice little yeah I think that deflected It didn't. Just a poor shot. It was a nice little dummy from Harrington though. He just let it let it go through his legs. Good tackle and Harrington's in there and he scores. That is shocking defending. Gotta feel sorry for the keeper. First goal, he had no chance on with a massive deflection. And then this one the defender just gives it up within the uh, the penalty box. Absolute cardinal sin. Although, probably not the best of passes from the keeper. Could have played it to someone else. Yes, yeah, so maybe the keeper is slightly to blame there. Not the player you should pass it. I mean, you can see Houghton closing in. Nice win. And he's a uh, calm and slot away. That should be the match wrapped up. Let's see if we can maybe get another goal. Certainly hasn't been one of my most impressive games this season. Oh, what a finish that was. Wow. Nice one two, but the finish is uh that's lovely. He just sort of shifts it inside and then actually uses the outside of his left foot, which is probably the wrong foot to use. So the game is certainly not over yet. Telegraphed a little bit there, but Bajer wins it back. And again. Ooh. It's all going off there. Again, being risky at the back, they don't need to do that. You know, they haven't got world class players. It's just cost them not long ago. Nicely done, just keeping the ball, trying to find some space.
Nice ball out to Bouget. Oh, what a finish. What a lovely goal that was. What a team goal. Fast passing, one twos, little triangles. And Vieira at the heart of it all. So he's had two a day now. I'm sure he'll get man of the match. Himself and Herrera have been probably the stars of our team. That'd be a throw in. Bit of a loose pass from Bouget, he was just stretching. Castledean. Oh, what a finish. And Vieira on the assist. Hunt now. I thought about going for it, cutting, sort of cutting around and taking a shot for his hat trick, but that was the right option. Nice layoff to Castledean and a powerful finish. Look at that, perfectly weighted. Nice touch. Keeper's got no chance there. And for a brief moment, they were back in it. Um, to be right, the, the, well, they've had two chances and scored with one of them. The other was the header that they just hit over. But they haven't been in the game other than that, really, have they? I mean, yeah, we weren't playing at our best. And we're worried that we're giving the ball away a little bit in the first half. But, um, you know, they didn't actually have any chances out of it. That's sloppy. Well done, Vieira, for winning that back. Give it away again. What is going on here? Well, that's just fired into Vieira's heel, but there it is. Full time. Comfortable in the end, but it looked a bit... Uh, Dicey in the first half. And in the end, just under 60% possession. Massive amount of passes compared to theirs. Exactly what we expected. We dominated the attacking thirds. And man of the match, Fabio Vieira, without a doubt. Herrera, like I said, he was really good. Castledean was really good. Harrington getting on the score sheet. Carlos Perez was not the best today. But all round, pretty impressive performance with all of the changes that were made. But that's it for this week, guys. Next time we're away to Levante... We will have had a week's break, so our squad should be replenished and back up to full strength. Thanks for joining. Please leave a like if you can. Drop a comment down below and think about subscribing if you want to keep up to date with the channel. But I'll see you all next time. Cheers.